Hey everyone and welcome to the club. Today I'm going to be showing you how to draw Licky Tongue from Pokemon. Let's get started at the top of our page with the upper edge of the mouth. So we're going to start on the right side. I'm going to curve down in the middle and then back up on the right side. Now I'm going to curl down the side of the mouth down towards a corner of the mouth down to right about there. Now I'm just going to hook this back in and up with a short curve. Now from this point, I want to draw the curve for the center point of the tongue. Starting up here, we're going to curve up. And I'm just going to curve that down and out towards the right, to right about there. Now I'm going to layer the outside of the tongue in behind the center line. Starting up here, we're going to curve up. Curve all the way down towards the bottom of the tongue. I'm going to round out the bottom of the tongue. Now I want to pull this back up towards that point here. So we're going to continue that curve going up. We go straight up. Now right at the top, we're going to curl over in the opposite direction. Let's go back to the right side. I'm going to step in and curve in and then down in behind the tongue. Now we're going to draw in the eyes. From this curve, we're going to step up and draw in a circle. Draw in the left eye. Now from this point, I'm going to go up and draw in the right eye with the same size circle. Now on the top left of each eye, I'm going to draw a small circle for a highlight. And then we're going to fill in the bottom half in black. At the bottom of this curve, we're going to step up and draw the nostrils. So we're going to draw two short angled lines coming down and then in. Let's move over to the right side. On the side of the right eye, I'm going to curve out the cheek and then pull that in. Now I'm going to curl this down in behind the tongue. Now we're going to move up and draw on the top of the head. So on top of the right eye, I'm going to curve up towards the top. Now I just want to pull this down towards the side of the neck. Come around and then down to right about there. From this point, I want to bulge out the back, going out and then down. Now I'm going to overlap the left arm on top of the body. So we're going to step in, curve out over that line, come down, we're going to round out the hand, and we're going to pull that up to right about there. I want to add a little spike. So we're going to draw the socket, like a little half circle. Now from those two points, I'm going to come in towards a point. Now let's continue the inside of the arm. In behind the spike, we're going to curve up, and just pull that over. Now we're going to continue the back in behind the arm. We're going to pull that down and in with a short curve. Now we're going to overlap the leg. Stepping up and in, curve out, and just pull that in towards the bottom of the foot. Let's round out the bottom of the foot. From here we're going to curve down and across. We're going to overlap the toe. From here we're going to curve up, round it out, and then just pull that back in. It's almost like drawing an oval. Now on the outside of the toe, we're going to curve in, up, and then back over towards the left. Now on the inside of the left leg, I'm going to curve down the belly, and we're going to pull that up in behind the tongue. Let's take the bottom part of this leg and just duplicate it in behind the body and the tongue. So we're going to start with the back of the leg, right up here, and curve down and in. We're going to round out the bottom of the foot to the toe. Now let's draw on the toe. We're going to go up, round it out, and then pull that back in. At the top of the toe, we're going to curve up in behind the tongue. Now we're going to tuck the right arm in behind the tongue. So we're going to take this arm and flip it over. So we start at the top, curve out, round up the arm. And we're just going to pull that into right about there. We're going to add that spike. We'll add the socket. Now from those two points, we're going to angle down and in towards the center. Now on the outside, we're going to curve up in behind the tongue. Now we're going to move to the left side and draw on the tail. On the side of the leg, we're going to curve out and up around the arm and go up to right about there. Now we're going to draw on the outside of the tail. Starting right where the head meets the back, we're going to curve up, around, we're going to pull that in. Now we're just going to flick it out at the bottom. Now here we're just going to tuck this in behind this curve. Curving up and then in. On the inside of the left leg, we're going to add a circle. 
Let's draw a smaller circle on the inside, leave an even space gap all the way around. And then the last thing we do is add the stripes along the body. We start in behind the tongue, curve out and up around the corner of the mouth. Now I'm gonna scoop this down, curve down, then across in behind the tongue. Let's add another stripe in below. Stepping down, curve out, and then up. Now we're gonna curve down, and then again, in behind the tongue. We're gonna add one more in behind the leg. So on the inside of the left leg, we're gonna curve down, and up in behind the tongue. Step down, we're gonna draw that curve one more time. And that's pretty much it. There we have it, there's Licky Tongue from Pokemon. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe, and send me your requests in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again soon.